Hey, it's the Dominator, and welcome to my uh, Madden Ultimate team. I got a Giants theme team, and just to show off a little bit, to show you what I got so far. Um, so far, I got one line, <clears throat> one giant lineman, Mark Glow. Uh, I'm also picking up uh, another gi uh, giant that actually dropped for the most fear. I think it was like part three or part four. I'm not sure. It's probably the last time. So um, he would be replacing this guy, left guard. Or no, sorry, left tackle. Sorry. Um, Anthony Munez. Hopefully he'll be better than Anthony Munez. And I can sell Anthony Munez back to the, to the auction and be able to do something with him. But for my big Giants right now, David Casper never was a Giant, but they upgraded him uh, to a Giants chem and all teams chem. So I chose Giants, obviously. Um, double me, et cetera. You know. um, I got Plaxico Birds. You got to have him on your squad. He's won a Super Bowl with the Giants. You know, he's a baller. He's a beast. Uh, he was with the Pittsburgh Steelers at one point. They got a Pittsburgh Steelers chem. Uh, moving on to Herman Moore, he was a Lion, but uh, he also played for the Giants. Uh, Alex, he's not with the squad, with the Giants right now currently on the roster, but he's in my roster because he is a beast. Still sitting at 88 overall. I think he was at 87 overall, but when you look at his stats, it got boosted um, by the Giants chem, and it's amazing. So don't have anything on from him right now. But um, he's obviously a third string receiver and I don't really see it. He doesn't really see the fourth four string receiver. He doesn't really see the field. Uh, then I got Brandon Marshall. Yes, he was on this giant squad at one point. So was the Jets and he was always a bear as well. So but um, he was hurt with the Giants. We didn't really get, him, get to see too much of him. Probably had a couple of receptions before he got injured and I was it. Um, but I got him as a giant and he's a beast because his height and his speed uh, agility whatsoever. Now you got uh, Sterling Shepard. Sterling Shepard is uh, he's a go to receiver, but he's injured for the rest of the year. I think he tore his MCL or ACL, excuse me. And that really sucks. I got Daniel Jones in the backfield. But let me talk about this for a second, bro. The Giants right now are currently six and one. Six and one. This is the card that we have to answer to every week if we play with him in the game if you look at his stats yeah let's compare um i got him boosted a little bit but i mean look at his stats compared to everyone's i mean his deep throw accuracy is just as good as uh it's just in fields but everything else bro look at this this is atrocious you know what I mean? Like they need to give him an upgraded card. I've been asking for it for the longest and no one's ha they haven't given it to him yet. Everybody else, they even get for this week, they gave losers a card. How do you give losers a Packer? The Packers lost to I think the the Washington Commanders and they gave one of the guys a card. So I'm like, "Bro, you know what the heck is wrong with that, bro?" And also I got a uh, Saquon Barkley over here, you know, he's sitting at a 91. I think his card is a 90. He's boosted very well with the Giants. I think I have, uh, let's see, I think I have 40 as a components or whatever. It's because uh, I have my Giants filled up, filling up the roster. If that, if you see that, I got a field uh, fullback, Larry Zonka. Yes, he was a Dolphin, but he received the all chem because he's a team captain and they should have did that a long time ago. They added him probably like, or added that to the card several, I think it was like two weeks ago when the season pa season pass season two pass came out. So, um, obviously let's go to the tight ends. I got Jeremy Shockey, um, great legend, you know, for the giants, he's a beast. And then, um, I got Evan Ingram. He showed out for the giants. He always was injured, you know, off and off the field. Um, I blame the trainers, but he's on my squad and he's a consistent catcher. So you always see him in the game. Everything is deep with that. Then I got backups here um, for uh, Andrew Thomas. Yeah, I think it's Andrew Thomas. He's getting the card. So that's going to be another giant. That's going to be awesome um, as an 89. I think he's going to be a 90. Sorry. So that's going to be a good upgrade. Uh, other than that, that's our, uh, that's all we got for offense. Let's slide over to defense uh, right now. I got a mixture of people on defense because, like I said, there's only a few Giants that I have. Um, let's start off with uh, Kayvon. Um, Kayvon was a beast with his early card in the beginning of the season, um, season one. And he's also a beast right now, obviously, in the game. So they actually gave him a card during the week, which was dope uh, for team of the week. And I had to cap that ASAP. You know what I'm saying? 
Devon Kennard. He was with the Giants at one point. He switched over to the Cardinals. But uh, he has a Giants camp, so that kind of helps out with the right linebacker position. Um, he also like plays D-line and stuff like that, so that kind of helps out with the squad. He's got some good pass-rushing defensive skills. Uh, Ted Hendricks, man, this guy's freaking freakish tall. Uh, he came from the the Latino uh, the Latino game. <laughs> nah, he came for the Latino uh, promo that we had going on, and, and he is a beast. Uh, also, Jonathan Casillas, he also came with the Latino uh, program as well, and he's just his speed is ridiculous. I added plus one speed with the 40 components and he's just running all over the place right now. I don't currently have him starting because I had to get Bobby Wagner in there to see how he is right now. He's so, he looks tiny to me, but he's still like six, four, which is weird. I don't know. Um, Tay Crowder. I'm hoping he gets a card very soon here. He's been beast at uh, his linebacker position. Uh, but you know, moving forward, uh, obviously Lawrence Taylor, hopefully they give us some upgraded, um, solos that we can do so we can upgrade him because he's all Madden team all Madden team should all reach 99 so that's going to be something very soon here when we see that hopefully they can drop some um power-ups for him um I also have Carl Banks as a left linebacker uh he was good for a while until he actually started slacking on my team so I had to like you know let him go you know not let him go but put him you know bench him a little bit but he still does well i mean he's he's in plays you know special teams as well kickoff going to xavier uh mckinney bro they need to give him a card asap bro like he's a freaking iron man right now this dude has not missed a freaking game god forbid you know knock on wood hopefully they keep him in the game hopefully he's, he's very healthy throughout the season because he's a he's pretty dope he's pretty dope um the giants actually picked up Landon Collins as a um, as a strong safety or free safety so I want to see, I'll see how inter- uh, it's going to be interesting to see how that works Logan Ryan's with the the Tampa Bay Buccaneers but he's a giant in the past and he's still good on special teams so I keep him in there right now um, you can look at my starting corners right here I'm not going to get into it too much Griffin Sauce Gardner and uh, Stefan Gilmore you know I'm gonna have those but I'm also have uh, Denard um, he's a, uh, sorry, he's a 49er, but he has Giants chem as well. He was on the squad a little bit. And then also I had James Bradbury. He's not on the squad. He's with the Eagles right now. He's probably balling right now. He's there. They're just on fire off all, all cylinders. He's probably going to get a card very soon here too. Uh, before da- Daniel Jones gets a card, you know, that's, that's, that's trash, but you know, it is what it is. You know, they just, they just got to play people. Um, I got the uh, OG Michael Strahan. Hopefully, they'll drop some more power ups for him, so he can push up to a 95, 96, probably even 99, because that's what he deserves. He's he's a legend, you know what I'm saying? Same thing with Keith Hamilton. Hopefully, they uh, buff him up uh, later down the line as well. Um, right now, I got uh, Leonard Williams as the D tackle. I had to slide him in there because he's a, he has Giants cam and everything. So um, also. But his, his main position is right end. Hopefully they'll upgrade him down the line. Hopefully they do well. And I got uh, DJ Davison. Uh, I don't even know if he's on the squad, but he's a rookie. Defensive tackle, he's in there. Uh, Justin Ellis is in there as well. Then I got Dexter Lawrence. He's quite possibly definitely going to get a card. And it's probably going like to be like a 90 or 91 or 92. So that's going to be very, very, very interesting. Um so that's it for what I have as far as uh, for the Giants wise. I have Riley Dixon as a uh, Giant. Um, I don't even know if he's on the squad, but uh, Graham Gano obviously he's on the squad. I had to keep him at, at that position. So that's going to be deep. It's going to be pretty decent. And uh, that's about it. This is my squad right now. You know, pick so um, nothing too flashy, but you know we got to get into it. So let's go ahead and jump into a uh, head-to-head game real quick. Uh, let's check it out. So let's do a head-to-head game. I got Justin Fields in there, but my quarterback, um, Plunkett, he was my quarterback. So I want to test him out. I want to test uh, Justin Fields out, see how he does. And uh, let's get this started.
And that's about it. And that's how you uh, get the job done. I know you wasn't really too good as far as on that skill level. But um, Giants look pretty pretty decent right now, you know, as far as uh, Madden Ultimate Team. Uh, you just got to make it work, man. You got to figure it out. Let's look at the season pass real quick. Or the season uh, field pass. And, uh, I mean, I'm almost, yeah, I'm level 33. You know, I'm almost there. Um, I'm on verge of grabbing his Josh Allen. I'm, see, I'm really th- actually wanted to see how he d- actually plays. But honestly, sometimes, like, like I like I said, I'm playing with these two quarterbacks that I'm playing right with right now, and I'm pretty decent. Like I said, I'm not that serious. So I'm waiting on this Deion Sanders, though, as he's going to be monster. Uh, let's see. Uh, most fear, that's that's been completed. That most fear, they need to go ahead and take this off ASAP. You know what I mean? So, and then uh, competitive wise, I'm I'm moving, I'm moving up the line. I got seven wins right now, but um, slowly get better. You know, see how that goes, see what happens. But that's all I got for today, man. It's a dominator. You know, like, subscribe. You know, uh, just you know, see see what you want to do, man. I mean, like I said, if you want to follow a Giants team team all the way throughout the season, and that's that's your bit. I should be dropping videos at least uh once or twice a week. You can also follow me on Twitch as well, and I'll put that in the description. And um, like I said, uh, Giants all in. Play it, play. You know what I'm saying? Like just be just be yourself, bro. Deuces.